Planet detected. Scanning. Scanning. Warning. Life form detected. Life form identified. Frank Sicardi of Cyborg Prime Games. Incoming transmission. Hello, everybody. <clears throat> That was a uh, cool interview with Mr. Christopher Griffin. Uh, I've been sidebarring him. He's uh, uh, trying to catch up with us, and he's going to try to join us, so uh, we'll give him a minute. Uh, Ricard, you might want to unmute your mic, and uh, Gomos, uh, looks like you're here too. <clears throat> We're going to uh, have a uh, giveaway of the next um, prize pack, which is uh, sponsored by Christopher Griffin. It's the... Uh, uh, it's a t-shirt with the Maker God uh, cover design on it, which is pretty awesome. Um, I saw it this afternoon. It's like a silk screen. It's the, well, look at the Maker God um, image for the, uh, for, for his module. And it's just the ship. And it's like, it's pretty cool. Did a great job. I believe the ship is by Ian Stead. So, uh, you know, there's another one of our guests there uh, putting their, <laughs> their uh, heads together and coming up with uh, cool things. So, yeah, there we go. Gomos, are you with me? I am with you. Ricard, are you present? Your mic is on mute. Uh oh, he must have might have stepped away, stepped away. So um, while we're waiting on, uh, oh, it's not too late to uh, register for the drawing, folks. Uh, you're going to get uh, this uh, Maker God uh, T-shirt, and you're going to get a, an Ad Astra Pewter uh, Mini, a ship mini, and um, uh, yeah, and uh, the way to register is to go to www.cyborgprime.com, hit the blog, you'll see the event, uh, the entry for the event page, go in there, and uh, down in the uh, prize listings, you'll see a place to register, and I'll kill a little bit of time to give folks a chance to get in there and register. In the meantime, let's have a little chat about, uh, you know, um, previous okay. interview hey there you go hey ricard welcome back um so the previous interview with uh, mike leonard uh, he was talking about you know he makes uh paper minis and he's going to make them for v for virtual tabletop um regarding those uh gomos uh, what's your tell us about your character what's it look like uh, what's your what's your character token or character portrait look like for uh for dr gomos well uh the doctor is um on one side of things, he comes from uh, not quite, like, not a feudal planet. Uh, I don't remember the text level. I think it was six or seven. Mm -hmm. um, so, like, muskets and barely steam-powered kind of thing. So he, he definitely has an old-timey vibe to him. Um, aside from that, he is uh, super, super skinny. Um, uh, like, my strength is, what is it, three? It's like three four, or something. something like that? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I, I tank the roll, so I'm I'm just like walking skin and bones. We keep making jokes about how I get out of breath walking down the corridor and stuff like that. Um, uh, my character avatar in game, which kind of works, is a shot of uh, uh, Steve Rogers, Captain America, but before the serum from the Marvels movies when he's all like mm -hmm. skinny in the 1940s clothing. That's right. uh, that's what I've been rocking with. Yeah, cool. And Ricard, what's your character look like? Uh, uh, Ricard, come in. Come in, Ricard. Uh, Getting all scratchy with the mic. Hello. Hey, there you are. Tell us okay. a little bit about uh, Ice. What does he look like, and uh, um, how, impor how important is it that your uh, character portrait looks pleasing or oh, you know, in line with well, your character? It's, it's nice. It just it kind of uh, it just is just an anchor. You know everything uh, with the you know everything helps. But um, the um, yeah, he's just uh, you know bushy, you know cropped hair, you know um, goatee, beard, you know Van Dyke kind of guy. Mm -hmm. Always wearing uh, goggles. Always has a wrench in his hand. If he's not in his vac suit, he's in like a leather jacket and work pants. You know, like you know the cargo tool pants and boots. And uh, just always about uh, inspecting something. So it's like, 
Uh, cool, always has cool. some scanner or like trying to communicate with some piece of machinery while everybody's like drinking or doing something else. Right. Yes, you are. Your character is industrious while the others are slackers. No. For the most part. For the most part. No, they always do. Especially their Mr. Stuff Katz. Like God, what a slacker. I don't think. Yeah. You know, no, it's just uh, everybody just shines when they see their moment. They're pretty much. I don't know. It's almost like everybody's a loner to each other until something important is needed, and then they just step up. So. Yeah, I've noticed that. That's uh, one cool thing that I really like about Traveler is like the synergy that you can play with the you know the different characters. Like when you guys go to a um, go into this dangerous area, uh, everybody mans their station and they all ride out this like you know basically going down the rapids in their ship, and um, it's it's pretty awesome. I mean, uh, you guys all make good rolls. Uh, you know, you keep the ship from exploding um, and uh, keep it on course. And uh, it's amazing the synergy that the characters get. And uh, that's not something yeah, that you I, see. I feel like we're lucky that uh, between our characters, we sort of tick all the important boxes when it comes to skills. Yeah. Um, we're not right. really prevented from doing anything, uh, even right. though some of our characters can't do some stuff. Right, right. All right, so let's uh, we're, we're going to pick the next winner here for the um, for the uh, Christopher Griffin Pies pack. That's a Maker God T-shirt and a uh, pewter mini from uh, Ad Astra Games. Let's see, I pick number forty-six. Forty-six. Stephen Luer, you are the winner of our um, Maker God and uh, Pewter at Astra ship um, prize pack. Congratulations. I will contact you by email and arrange for delivery of said prizes. Um, congratulations. And um, let's see, we got another 10 minutes to kill. I'm going to do another uh, prize giveaway here in a few minutes. Um, uh, I'll, I'll announce it in about three minutes. We'll have about five minutes-ish before the... The next, um, we have our, our keynote speaker coming up at the uh, bottom of the hour. Um, that's Matthew Sprange of Mongoose Publishing. Uh, something a little inspirational about him. You know, he just decided uh, one day to start uh, Mongoose, and so he did. And he was like, uh, you know, um, I like uh, I like Traveler, so I want, to, I want to have that license. And so he arranged to do it. So it's kind of inspiring, you know. Um, uh, reach out and take it. Reach out and to take it. Just saying, if there's something you, you want to envision and something you want in your life, just to uh, make it happen, uh, you can do it. And that's a story of how Matthew Sprange started uh, Mongoose Publishing. Now, he's really interesting, and uh, he's coming up at the bottom of the hour. And so we'll have another drawing uh, before that. I think, uh, you know, I'm feeling a little bit generous. I want to give out a, uh, um, I want to give out a Far Trader deck plans for virtual tabletop. I, I made it to work with uh, Roll20, but it'll work with uh, found, uh, Foundry or any virtual tabletop that lets you import um, graphics, graphic assets, and you can use this as your uh, your uh, home for your travelers, or you can use it for uh, boarding actions or whatever you want. Um, you can uh, there's empty rooms that you can decorate with furniture, and uh, or you can do it comes in furnished and unfurnished, and then uh, along with that, I'm also going to give you a a uh, copy of Humanoid Resources, uh, your choice of um, 36 pre-rolled merchants or 36 pre-rolled uh, naval characters, um, your choice. So I'll be drawing that uh, for a minute. And I'm not drawing that. I'm going to, that's going to be related to a uh, trivia question because I like, I like trivia. And I wanted ways for people to uh, win prizes without having to necessarily go through the process of entering the drawing, but uh, do enter the drawing because there are still, um, we're going to give away a Deep Night Revelation box set from uh, uh, Mongoose Publishing. It's like a physical set they're going to ship to you, and it's a, it's a campaign. It's a, uh, it's a campaign. It's really, really nice. And um, then at the end of the night, when we wrap this all up, we're going to um, 
give away a ginormous prize pack with all kinds of goodies. Um, let's see. Oh, I'm also going to give away uh, a copy of The Wagner Incident, which is a, uh, a traveler novel about uh, an encounter with the drawing. So that will be part of the, this little prize package I'm about to give away. Um, that's by um, uh, uh, Arcane Fortress Publishing. Um, yes. And uh, what else? All right. It's uh, let's see. I'll give people five minutes or so to answer this trivia question. Since since uh, since I'm giving away a proprietor class, Far Trader uh, deck plans. And this is going to be a question about trivia question about merchants. Ready? I'll take the first correct answer on any of the input channels. So uh, it'll go by timestamp between Discord, uh, YouTube, and Twitch. Here we go. Trivia question is. What's the name of the merchant who kidnapped Lieutenant Commander Data to keep him in his private menagerie of unique items? Only answer if you want to win the prize. Don't spoil it. We'll just leave those channels open. You can answer on the uh, Discord, the YouTube, or on uh, Twitch. First correct answer wins a uh, Far Trader deck plans for VTT. And their uh, their choice of 36 pre-rolled merchants or 36 pre-rolled naval characters. What's the name of the merchant who kidnapped Lieutenant Commander Data and added him to his collection of unique items? Ricard, have you ever come across a crooked uh, merchant? <coughs> Uh, crooked merchant. Um. <laughs> but we have a winner. We have a winner. We have a winner. Jay Slattery. You won something from the drawing earlier, I believe, and now you also won the trivia question. Yay. So congratulations. Yay. Let's see. I will uh, mark you down here. You just uh, won a uh, copy of the Far Trader deck plans, and uh, would you like um, the uh, 36 pre-rolled merchants or 36 pre-rolled naval characters? Oh, don't check your email just yet. Uh, I haven't sent the stuff out. <laughs> I'm much too busy running the event. After the event, I'll contact everybody by email. All right, Jay. Um, Jay, uh, set, uh, PM me your email address just to make sure I have it in case I was wrong about already drawing your name for another prize. Um, and I'll get make sure you get those naval characters as well. Cool. All right. We've got about two and a half minutes. Uh, oh yeah. So you're getting a. Uh, you're also getting a copy of the Wagner Incident, which is a. Uh, Traveler novel uh, about an encounter with the drone. Very interesting. Alrighty. Cool. All right, guys. The next uh, next thing coming up is Matthew Sprange in uh, about two minutes. Um, so it looks like uh, uh, after that um, we're going to draw the uh, the Deep Knight Revelation box set winner uh, from the registered. Uh, people so get on to cyborgprime.com and head over to the blog and uh, get on the event page and find the area for that lists the gigantic avalanche of prizes and get yourself registered because the big grand prize is coming up at the end of the night and the prize list is just mind-bogglingly awesome uh, you'll find links to all of the uh, all of tonight's guests and their, uh, their, their various titles. You'll find all kinds of resources. You'll find ways to get to the Traveler Charity Game, which is going on right now. We're raising money for uh, to benefit the Carcinoid Cancer Foundation. So pop on over to that. You can reach it through um, the, the event page on the Cyborg Prime website or through the Traveler for Charity channel over here on Discord. Um, let's see. 
All right. Um, we'll have another uh, little get together after this. And so stay tuned, everybody. And uh, while I'm waiting, uh, thanks to the crew. Uh, you guys rock. Um, you've been with me through this entire um, broadcast. We're going over 12 hours now of nonstop traveler goodness. So uh, thank you guys. Uh, Hashtag I teamwork. I couldn't think of a better crew. So thank you for uh, manning your stations. Oh, you guys. All right. So here we go with uh, Matthew Sprange, Mongoose Publishing.